We did it. Back to our stupid reaction to I'm Corbin. I'm Rick. And you can follow us on Instagram and Twitter for more juicy content. It's so juicy. The high fly ball. <laughs> uh, we're in a chipper mood. You know, uh, you know, you realize why we we wanted to see it in Telugu. Yeah. So, like, we obviously this is you've seen the title. We are reviewing. You say the title because I can't see the whole title. Tira. Narasima ready. Yes, I can't say that middle word. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's Narasima. Um, yeah, you heard it say Sierra it Narasima time for the film, and I couldn't yeah, say all it. the time. Narasima uh, ready. <laughs> so uh, it came out uh, a couple days ago. Yeah, uh, last week. Last week, uh, like we, Thursday, we saw War, uh, which came out a day earlier. Yes, uh, and so people got upset and saying we didn't we were watching uh, that instead of this and or even instead of joker yes it just happened to be released here in la before those other films so we finally got to it i'm and sorry was, it took a little while and this was released in telugu and hindi we could have seen it in hindi we didn't want to we wanted to see it in telugu in the original language yes so and there was only like one showing a day yeah at theaters in guam we're, we're in la so there's very few we went to a theater we've never been to before to see it in telugu but, yes, we finally saw it. Uh, go ahead. It is a historical action epic inspired by the life of Uyilawada Narashmi Reddy, who revolted against the atrocities of the East India Company ten years before the Sepoy Mutiny. That's cool. Yeah. Uh, it's directed by... Surrender Reddy. Uh, and I think he... Wrote, yeah, he was part One of the writers. writers. And There's then, a team of writers. Uh, and then obviously starring... I Chirinjiri. can't say. How do you say it? I think it's Chiranjivi. Chiranjivi. The legend. I can't say it. I'm yeah. not even going to attempt. Uh, and then a small part, Samatak Bakchan. And uh, the couple, uh, the, the two main females, I believe one is this one. Who plays Lakshmi, yes, was, uh, uh, I believe it's pronounced Tamana Bhatia. And then she was in Bahubali. In she Bahubali was in Bahubali. Two. Yes. And then. As we, was, there were, there were lots of faces from Bahubali in this that we recognized. Who was the, was this the other one? Uh, the mother. No, not her. She she played uh, the other woman. Yeah, the other woman. Yeah. Uh, Before we're gonna give a non-spoiler and then a spoiler. Yeah, we'll do a little small non-spoiler review and then we'll. But get I believe spoiler. the woman who plays his mother in this plays Bahubali's mother. Oh, does she? I think so. Yeah, it could be. Yeah. Uh, very. And, and then we recognized the the guy, like his buddy. Very similar in terms of how epic it was, this was in terms this of Bahubali, epic. but better because Way I think better. one obviously they have better technology now and they probably had more funding. Honestly, yeah, uh, yeah. So that, my understanding as well. Speaking of Fundy, is that Big B just did this to do it? He like did it for free. Yeah, is our understanding. Yeah, he so, got a big thank you in the, right at the beginning. The beginning. Yeah, big thank, thank you to Mr. Amitabh Bachchan with his picture on it. You kind of got to if he joins your film. I, yeah, I mean, come on, if he does a movie for free. <laughs> yeah, so this is a, and it's inspired obviously by the, uh, but yeah, the, a true story um, of a story. I mean, I knew obviously there's a tons of these stories about the British in India and so. Yeah. You know, probably a thousands of these kinds of stories. Right. But this is an epic film. That's just that's the word for it. It's uh, epic. And it's it's beautiful. Mm -hmm. It's so like well done. It's it's very stylistic. Sometimes as stylistic as like a three hundred. Not comparing it to three hundred. It's nothing like three hundred. But certain times they do have that same the stylistic type of, uh, vibe. Uh, but most of the time it's it's very stylistic, but very almost. I can't put my word. Uh, I can't even say. Wow, you can't even talk. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> of like how like pretty it was and ex like expansive. It was a massive production. Massive, 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 massive production. Yeah, like at every level. And uh, this is our second Telugu film, I believe. I after think Baku so. Bali. After Baku Bali, yeah. Correct. I think that is correct because the uh, KGF was something with a K. Canada. Is it Canada? Is I think it's Canada, Canada, yeah. Okay. Um, but I think everybody in this, we'll just start with the non-spoiler stuff, and then we'll get into spoilers, because that's, I think, what we're, we, we enjoy talking about more. Uh, this main guy, uh, I believed him as the... Totally. Godlike... 100%. Um, hero. Yeah. In this. And you know what they did in this? <laughs> they, they made him epic uh, in the way... I mean, the most 
the most uh, close example we have of Indian film would be Bapu Bali. They made him epic, but they didn't exaggerate him. Like, war is ridiculous. Yeah. Like, the way they over-exaggerated Rithik's entrance yeah. was, like, just laughable ridiculousness. Well, the, most, the closest they got to that is every single time he, he did a stash, Right, like, he was, was hilarious. That was pretty awesome. I love that. But, yeah, I totally believed the guy in the role. Uh, and then, uh, obviously, all the... Honestly, of the not guy, just... The legend. Yeah, not just in India, but in just cinema in general. These are some of the prettiest choreographed war scenes I've ever seen. I, I agree. We were sitting in there and I don't know how many times during the film I'm sitting here watching it and there was, a, there was like one other guy in there with us. Yeah. And I remember sitting and thinking we're sitting here in the quote unquote entertainment capital of the world. We're in Hollywood and millions of people around us right now don't have the foggiest idea this level of capacity in filmmaking is coming out of India, let alone a non-Bollywood film. Yeah. They have no... And a year ago, we were in that group. Oh, yeah. There are people <laughs> sitting in the movie theaters watching films that we had no clue were being made that were at the level that they're at. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, this is definitely one of those that you, you need to go see in theaters. It's on a big screen. With a bunch oh. of people. I wish we got to see this with a bunch of people I know. in India. I with think. a big screen and big sound. I mean, if a movie was made for big screen and big sound, it's this movie. Yeah. this It had a bad almost every... I mean, it's, like every it's, 20 it's, minutes. Yeah, it's a long film, but every 20 minutes there was another battle. There was either an epic battle or an epic dance number. Yeah. Two, the two dance, dance numbers, numbers in this were amazing. Quite enjoyable. I People asked us to react to them, but I didn't. They were T-series, so it's just one of those things that it, you, you can't do. It's probably going to get blocked or copyrighted. Right, yeah. Um, but uh, I'm glad we didn't because it, it was kind of really enjoyable to see this two very... Well, the first one was completely and utterly just massively Unbelievably epic. Unbelievably massive. It was like a parade yeah. almost. The costuming, the number of people, uh, the makeup, the music, the choreography, it was off the yeah. freaking charts. Uh, then uh, we'll get into the spoilers, but uh, I would definitely say go see this film. Oh, and the stunt work. Yeah, yeah. Definitely go see this film. And a huge ratchet uh, up with the CGI. I mean, there were some, there were some, there were some spots you're like, okay, yeah. Oh, yeah. But way, way above where they I mean they've come such a long way in oh, a yeah. short period of time yeah and for spending probably a fraction of what yes. you spend here in order to yes. do that kind of stuff yes. uh, obviously so that would so we know so okay, definitely so go see that we're gonna start talking spoilers if you haven't seen it yet see it come back I'm sure a lot of people have seen it so are. most of this is gonna be spoiler talk yep uh, but yeah this <laughs> this film um, and we could t talk about the kind of just the battle it almost starts off because when they Especially when they start to introduce him, because they start you off in the in the present, and there's that warrior queen right. thing. Yes, which I don't know what. Little is. side note: Can we talk about how epic and awesome the women are in this oh, movie? Yeah. And the first battle sequence I recall ever seeing, where the women are fighting alongside the men. Yeah. That final battle sequence when the women are just kicking butt. Yeah, it's that was awesome. That was great. Uh, there's multiple times in this where we out loud were like, yeah! Yeah. The, the stylistic of this film is beautiful, but also they, they took it up a notch in certain places that other like films kind of didn't or the CGI it was, it wasn't as good. Yeah. Like, because they... They showed some injuries in this oh, thing, man. Yeah. There were some epic sword throw shots. There were yep. some epic bone in showing slow shots. Mo. Oh man. <laughs> Cutting up in the you know, slice of people's faces and And the martial arts they put in in, in all this choreography. The fight choreography and the fight stunt work. And from what I believe, he did most of his own stunts. That's my understanding too, and he's sixty. That's <laughs> These were crazy. Right. Hashtag life goals. These were crazy stunts. Hashtag life goals. Man, that it was. It's such a fun film to watch. Uh, that like, it, it's not like I wouldn't take somebody who's never seen any film immediately to see this, but I think they would appreciate a lot of this. I do too. I just wouldn't I take it too. right away because right. it has a lot of cultural stuff in it. Yeah. Uh, so that's that's the only thing. But I think there's a since what seventy five percent of this is action scenes. They yeah. can appreciate. Every single one of they, those. Absolutely. Because every single one of them is amazing. <laughs> yeah, absolutely they could. And I think they could also appreciate, whereas in... Remember we watched two different films that they came out at the same time. 
in war were like, please don't give us the love story. Get, get that out of here. You're wasting our time. Yeah. I didn't feel that way with this. I felt like it was germane to the storytelling yeah. to have the, his love for Lakshmi and his wife and somewhat Bajramastani, but not, you yeah. know, of the two women who love him. Uh, I, I actually wanted a little more of that. I wanted, right. I wanted them to delve a little. I know, understand they couldn't because obviously it's already a long film. Yeah. Uh, and they got to get all those battle sequences in there because, yeah. man, there's a ton of them. Yeah. Um, but uh, my biggest gripe with the film, and I think it's yours too, is I don't know if it's the version you got, but the version we got, which yeah. we made sure we saw it in Telugu, they dubbed over the white people, the white yeah, generals. Yeah, all the Brits speak in English. They dubbed it with some other person doing Telugu. ADR work in Telugu. I, and we were really wishing we could have heard them speaking in English because we were... I, especially I, the main dude that we are certain is related to Christian Bale. Yeah, the first main Brit like that has the long hair. And he was identical to identical. Christian Bale. <laughs> Christian Bale sometimes. Who gets his head cut off. He and, was looking great. Yeah, we're like, I wish we could hear him because he actually looks like he's not doing the... This could have been our favorite white dude yeah. in an Indian film. Yeah. Uh, and and so we that, lost it because it was overdubbed with some guy in Telugu. I don't understand why they did it. Like, I... Uh, let and, people speak in their language. Yeah. They don't care if it's Indian. I don't exactly. care if it's Keep Chinese. the subs. Keep the subs in the language of the audience watching it. And then whatever other languages are being spoken, just let them speak in their languages. Yeah, so if they were speaking English, put Telugu subs. If you want to, sure. Yeah, so that the people speaking Telugu would be able to know what the English-speaking people are saying. Because it ruins performances when they're totally. dubbed. Totally. You like, lose. that's why we didn't want to see the film in Hindi. We I, wanted, exactly. We wanted to see it in its original and language. Did you find yourself looking at his lips? Yes. To see what he was actually saying at yeah. the time the words were coming up? Because I didn't want the, the overdubs. Yeah. Uh, and, and that actually what the, the English-speaking people were doing a yeah. good job. Yeah, he looked like he was, like, almost all of them. I mean, the Russell Crowe guy at the end was probably my least favorite uh, of the white people. Um, the but, Russell Crowe guy, the bearded dude? Yeah, the beard. Yeah. He, he was okay. He looked like a cross between Russell Crowe and then the other actor who was in Pirates and represented the East India. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That, yeah, yeah you know yeah, what I'm talking yeah, about? Yeah, yeah. yeah, he's a good actor. Um, but anyway. But uh, uh, that was probably my biggest gripe with this is that. I have like, gripe. like, oh, I have, I have a couple, but my biggest one is. That's the, the biggest. The dubs. It's like he was looking like he was a great villain. I know. He looked like he did a great job, and I, it got lost for anybody who doesn't speak Telugu or Hindi when they see the Hindi version. You don't. I think his performance gets lost because you don't hear him speaking and doing his work. You, it, like. <laughs> Why hire the actor to give the performance if you're just going to have somebody, somebody dub it? Yeah. I don't get it. I know. I don't get it. Like in any language, it's not just for English yeah. people. I, I like if it's if he's speaking Hindi, let him speak Hindi. Yeah. Don't overdub it. Right. If you, if you speak it Telugu, don't overdub let it. Let them speak the language. Like because that's the performance that we're looking for. Yeah. The other thing has nothing to do with this film. It has to do with the censorship board in India for films. Oh yeah. Every freaking time somebody gets a cigar out or has a drink. There's nothing that'll pull you away from suspension of disbelief and make you stop thinking you're in the time frame that yeah. the story's telling then you're watching them around a fire and someone gets a cigar out and down on the bottom comes this giant stamp. Smoking is injurious to your health. Every single time. <sighs> we get it. It's not this film, so we're not going to gripe on it. But <laughs> obviously, we have, I have a big problem with censorship in general. Um, but like, it's just... It's it's annoying and it takes up space on the screen and, and it distracts you. you. It. Uh, it even went over the 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 uh, freaking subtitles. Yeah, it did. Once again, not uh, the film's fault. Not the film's fault. We get it. Uh, it's the it's so what other gripes? What other little gripes? No, it's just it was, the, other than that. It was the little things like the um, like the uh, some CGI spots, but a couple of like, tiny little CGI spots. It's, it's nothing. The rest of it is so gloriously well done. I, I, I got that throw that away. Unlike War, I wanted them to actually delve in maybe cut one right. of the uh, the battle scenes to just delve into because like it was almost like okay he's married and then you had a great scene but then it was like 10 scenes later they're like oh yeah she's still here right because uh, i wanted them to feel a little more yeah i wanted to feel their relationship this film fills even non-indians with lots of pride and I can't imagine no. how Indians felt. That's we, what we walked, like, said at the end. I was like, I can't imagine how Indians felt watching this with the amount of pride. Yeah, because I there were a couple of times I got emotional. Mm -hmm. Like, I did, the tears didn't come down the cheeks, but I found myself getting emotional. I got emotional in his final speech, oh. and, his, and when his mother comes and she's capturing the yeah. blood in the thing. Oh, she did a great job. Great job. 
And I, I turned to Corbin at one point and I, I said it was during the fight sequence where he is going to go get the Christian Bale Brit guy. And I, I turned to Corbin and said, it must feel cathartic and wonderful for Indians to watch this and see Indians kicking, I didn't say crap, the crap out of Brits. Mm -hmm. And to see like the British flag on fire and just these battle sequences, there has got to be this cathartic sense that's rooted in the history of India of heck yeah, we have, you have something to be proud of, man, that we kicked the colonizers out. Yep. And that the death of every Indian for our motherland was not in vain because they're out. Uh, yeah. it's, it's just, this movie has got to fill Indians with us. Yeah. Just in the, in the same way that what's, what's a comparable film like, uh, I guess Saving Private Ryan. Yeah, any any film. any American film that touches on the, our nation and where we like a obviously, Pearl Harbor overcoming it happens and, happens but it's with any country that, that you're overcoming and you're filled with patriotism, patriotism, and, yeah, and all that kind of stuff. But this is even for non-Indians, yeah, you 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 felt it, you felt it a lot, a lot. in this film, and you felt the pride of uh, of the Indians that they feel for India and the pride they feel for their people. Yeah. Uh, and they, I think this is one of the best, like almost villains we've seen in any, in any, uh, I wish, like we said, I, I, I wish they weren't dubbed over yeah. because I feel like it could have been even more powerful. Yeah. Um, but like they, the, the villains in this really brought out the, the, the amount of pride, like the opposition yeah. that you needed. And I only had, I want to talk more about some great stuff like the score and the sound editing and the sound mixing. The the only other little gripe I had, which is what I have with a lot of the longer films and some of the stuff that we haven't seen a lot, but like Bahubali had this issue where, especially at the beginning of the film, rather than show us, they tell us. Yeah. So you'll see two people standing on the battlements and the enemy's there and they'll say to each other, They've been there ever since the revolt and 10 years ago. I know when Captain so-and-so did yeah. this and that. And yes, and all the people who gave their lives. It's they like, did that once or twice. They only did it once or twice. Yeah, it wasn't a lot. Thankfully. Thankfully. But I when that happens, I always, I go, oh, please stop. Well, we're, we're, um, yeah, we're not morons. Exactly. <laughs> but the, the, the score. Yeah, the score was throughout. really, really good. It, it helped to the, with the, the, the emotion. And the sound editing and mixing, the mm -hmm. matching of sound and visual effects was as good as anything we've seen come out of India. Yeah. And I thought this had a, a lot of really good twists and turns as well. Like stuff maybe yeah. new that I just, I didn't expect certain people dying. A lot of people died obviously this is the spoiler part a lot of people died right and a lot of people didn't die like main characters and then died yeah a lot of main <laughs> characters died which yeah. you don't see a lot that i did at least so far in indian cinema like you, you don't see the heroes die a lot yeah uh um, and the, the actress forgive me for not knowing her name off the top of my head plays lakshmi who was from bahubali huge growth for me oh yeah watching her do her work compared to bahubali yep uh, in, in this, I felt like she was, I felt pretty much everybody was going Oh yeah, I didn't see, time. there were, there was very few times that, uh, like, it, the only other times I would see things, it was a, a small extra. Part. Yeah, no, but all the main leads were really grounded. Of supporting guys. And the supporting people. Like the guy with the beard that, uh, he, he buffed up and uh -huh. then, right, as they said, we're not going to help you. And then he was like, we'll help you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He did really, really well. Yeah. Uh, and so like, it was only tiny little parts that, but most obviously Bakchan, right when he came on screen, man, I was like, this dude, he is so much presence. All the energy in the room just goes to big B. It's just, yeah. <sighs> he has so much presence. He does. Like, and it's, he's, he's effortless with, like, he's like, yeah, I'm Big B. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have to try. <laughs> he, he would make a great, um, Saruman. Oh, yeah, he would. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he would make a great Saruman. Epic Saruman. Yeah. Uh, anyway, this, I mean, as far as the movies you were going to see this week that were released, there's just no question. This oh, is, yeah. this is a giant epic film that you need to see on the big screen. War you never even need to see. Yeah. War is something that if you have nothing else to do and you wanted to go have fun and just laugh your butt off and enjoy great stunt work, yeah. go see War. But Good action. Compared to the two, it's like yeah. there is no comparison. Yeah. Yeah, I would definitely go see this uh, again, especially oh. over uh, War for oh, the weekend. Oh, hands down. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, this is, this is for, for the epics. 
And we haven't seen a lot, obviously. Yeah, we have. We still have a lot to see. But what immediately comes to my mind when I think about the, the, the epic stories that we've seen were Padmavat and Bajramastani. This goes way at the top of the list for me. Well, in terms of de definitely action, this definitely yeah. has more action than all of those. Yeah, and it kept me, I mean, it, this is a weird statement, what I'm about to say. It felt really long. Yeah. But I stayed engaged. Yeah. You know, I, I, it wasn't, I wasn't at moments looking at my clock going, oh, this is going to end. Yeah. It just, it felt long and I was like, okay, it's long. Good. In fact, I think that I turned to you at one point and went second intermission. <laughs> <laughs> it felt like, felt like we were going to get a second intermission. Yeah. I wonder uh, if they do that. But, and extremely, uh, for that little gripe I had about the script, you know, telling you something at the beginning, I thought the script and the pacing of the film and the way they took you through the story and all the way to the end, I thought was exceptional. Yeah. I thought it was really good. Yeah, I, I enjoyed that. I have very few issues with this film, biggest one being this the, the dubbing. And I don't know if that's what you got as well, if that's just what they gave us here. <laughs> they also had typos on some of the captions. Yeah, some of the, <laughs> some of the freaking They really subs. don't care about Americans. Like it's, it, the word because was spelled B-E-C-U-A-S-E. -E -E. I'm like, okay. <laughs> somebody, somebody rushed the subtitles to get this out. They yeah. were, they needed to release it at midnight and 11.53. They're still typing in the subtitles. I actually wanted to look up that white boy. Yeah, the guy who looks like Christian Bale. Yeah, what was his name? The, no idea. His character name was Jackson. It was Jackson? Uh-huh. Colonel Jackson, General Jackson. Or was it Watson? No, it was Jackson. He's, he's, oh, he's the young Jackson Jack. Immortal. Oscar Scudderberg. Yep, that's him. Yeah, it's so many times in different angles. He looks so much like Christian Bale. Real humans? Uh, he's from Stockholm. Ah, so he's a Swedish actor. Yeah, so he's done... He... Uh, go back up he's to He's relatively his... new. Where were you? Where's this around? When you did... Uh, that's a film. So the TV series, TV shows... I, I can't did. see anything from America. No, there's a, there's a, the reason I was looking at some of his TV credits is because there's a really popular show in Denmark that one of the actresses from Westworld is on. I wanted to see if he worked with her. But well, man, you did, I, I'm, I think you did a great job. I you did a good job I, too. I, I can't say for sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because they dubbed you, but you looked like you were intense and you were in it. So great job yeah. to you, sir. And great job to the legend. Yeah, uh, obviously. <laughs> he he was the whole time. He was completely he was captivating. believable, captivating, uh, believed his emotional state he was and, in. And good for you for doing all your own stunts at what, 60? 60 freaking years old, man. <laughs> yeah. And he had to, he had just some, some legit those were stumper. Those were like MMA almost like style. Oh, yeah, it's like... It's like, hey, hey, Tom Cruise, talk yeah. to me in a decade. <laughs> Hold my, yeah, it's a, look at Tom Cruise doing Mission Impossible. He shows up and says, Hold my beer. Hold my chai. Hold my chai. <laughs> I, I'll show you what I'll show you what real stunt work is. Yeah, folks. so I would definitely recommend this. Obviously, since you're here, you've already seen it. I would hope. Yeah, this is going to be one of the ones that would be at the top of my list. And I agree with you. I think people. I was really happy. There were two things we spotted that we've just learned this week. One of them was during the big musical number, we thought we saw a gory yeah. uh, uh, who were with the ash on them. And then another thing from the, that festival well, on the last day of Durga Puja. The people climbing the, the poles. Well, there was people climbing the poles and then there was, oh no, it was in the Akshay Kumar trailer when he's got the, the 10 heads. We're like, hey, I think we know what that cultural reference is. Yeah. So we're getting excited about yeah. Oh, and... We clearly, a lot of, like, an American seeing this for the first time, or just a non-Indian, wouldn't pick up on the significance of it. The very end, when that guy, when the guy, the dad, kills himself and falls at his feet and his hand hits his foot, the significance of him seeking to bless and be blessed at that moment was, we're then, learning thanks to you. And then also the girl who danced in front of them and then burned herself. Yeah, that, that was immediately brought to mind Padmala. Very similar to that uh, whole uh, ritual. Yes. If, if like their people die, right. they sacrifice themselves in a fire. Right, rather than be, be disgraced and, and yeah. all that kind of stuff. Yeah, so. uh, reminded me of that a lot. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I really up. enjoyed it. <laughs> definitely, definitely enjoyed it. Lived it up to the, the epic trailers that it yeah, gave us. Yeah, it really did. Uh, so uh, let us know what you thought about that conversation. Should be now! <laughs>